happy April Fool's Day. I guess I should come up with some kind of trick for you. I'll have to think about that. I should check CNN. I wonder if there's any fake headlines on there. Anyways, first I just want to show you this email that confirms everything I've been talking about. Yesterday I noticed an email, like, so I was going through all my emails and there was one about a contest. It's like you can win a microphone. So I said, I just opened this email and it says the contest is already closed. And he says, hi, Josh, the giveaway ended around two hours ago and had been open for over a week. Keep an eye on our social media channels for more giveaways. So that's what I'm talking about when my email is crammed with newsletters and just useless crap. I don't even get to contests in time. So this is why I'm sitting down and I'm plowing through the, the emails again. Okay, I gotta go out for dinner, but I have to tell you, there's a speed dating event in 40 minutes, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's for Toronto, but... People can go forever, from anywhere because I'm from Ottawa and I went to the Atlanta one last night. You can win cash. I won $200 last night or last week uh, with an Amazon card just for doing a trivia question. And it's speed dating and it's free because um, it's still in beta. They're testing the website and there's like a fun speed dating and then there's an after party and that's where I won the money. Um, but you can only get it through my special referral link. So DM me if you want to come. Okay, so why are we still up at 2 a.m. with fluff on our hat? Uh, we're going to keep this short because it's 2 a.m. Um, so I did that speed dating, and as usual, it went a long time. The actual dates themselves went for like two and a half hours at least, and then the after party started. And it was quite fun. It's just people in the chat, like going from room to room, talking. And uh, yeah, there's this one young man who's 23, was talking about dating. He was asking me, like, what's online dating like? And uh, I was giving him advice. And, uh, and then I talked to some other guy who was asking me how I see the future and do I think we're going to live forever and do I think you can put a chip in a brain and all of this. So I was telling him my thoughts. Oh, and I posted in a few dating groups and on my Facebook page inviting people to come to the speed dating. A few women messaged me. Um, but the, the event was so packed this time that they were having trouble getting people in and there were some technical glitches and it turned out I can't even post the link on Facebook because for some reason, maybe because it's a beta site or I don't know, but Facebook is flagging it as spam. So I had to make my own page and my own website and then direct people to that. It was all complicated, but, and I only started promoting it an hour before. So I'm going to tell you about next week's event, like starting tomorrow. So you can all sign up and hopefully you'll, you'll all come and have fun with me. Cause it's actually one of the best things I've, I've done in a while. Um, making all these friends and a lot of the, the women were influencers and actresses and stuff. And they're like, yeah, yeah, I want to do podcasts with you. So that'll all be fun. So yeah, look for those. Oh, I still got to, oops. Speaking of which I got to post my interview with that model that I did. When was that? Oh boy. Yeah, I'm way behind on posting things like that interview with her and and then interviews from the past few years. I really got to catch up on things. Uh, and that what I've been doing today is just going through my emails. Like I'm down to 380 or something now. Just plowing through, unsubscribing, replying to things from two years ago. Uh, trying, to, trying to just decide, yeah, what is important? Do I need all these affiliate links? Like what, what kind of things am I actually going to focus on? I think I just need to start my own businesses and focus on my content. And uh, yeah, so... I guess one more day of plowing three emails tomorrow, and, uh, and that's the weekend. Oh my god, time is... It's April already. Oh my god, what are we going to do this spring? What are we all doing? Oh, and I remembered what I did at noon today, because I woke up... When did I wake up this morning? Did I go to bed at 2 again? Yeah, and then I woke up... Or no, 11, I guess, 10.40. But I woke up at like eight and it wasn't enough sleep. Anyways, um, at noon I just beat or not the Toastmasters. It was like an open house for one of the Toastmasters group, and it was April Fool's themed, humor themed, and uh, and I we all secretly messaged a prank to the president, and then she read it out, and with everybody had to guess who did, who did the prank. And I told a story about how when I was a kid I used to set up this frisbee with water that would swing and hit people when they opened the garage door. Anyways, I'll, I, I filmed that little segment, so I'll remind me to play it for you tomorrow. It's kind of a fun little story of my life. All right, night. Oh, see, now I've gotten into a fourth segment. See, it goes 15, and then I'm like, can't stop right at the beginning of a segment. I gotta... Anyways, enough of this. Good night.